Hello everyone, welcome back to landscaping. Today we will be mowing lawns. We'll be heading over to the shop this morning here in the 2020 Chevy Duramax. Today we will be using the Skag Cheetah with a bagger system. We'll also be taking the Skag Walk Behind Leaf Blower. On the list for today's just over 9 residential lawns, mainly all of them will be in a few small subdivisions. I'm really excited to be back here with the landscaping company it's going to be a busy few months here for us as the leaves are falling we have quite a few fall leaf cleanups to do as the leaves start to fall all of our customers do request that we collect all of them so that's why uh, for the first time this season we have the bagger on the cheetah if you do enjoy today's video here, please drop a like, it's much appreciated as it helps out with the YouTube algorithms. Within the next few weeks, more and more leaves will be falling and we'll be ramping up uh, to do our big fall leaf cleanups with the Skag Leaf Vacuum and we will have to put the box on uh, the uh, Cummins dump truck as well to get that ready uh, to handle and hold all the leaves. And we have arrived here at the shop. Now it is a bit chilly. It is kind of sweatshirt weather nowadays. Uh, just over 55, 60 degrees kind of throughout the day. And this morning's a bit chilly at 45 degrees here. But let's get loaded up and head on out. Now we will also be using the 2017 Chevy 2500 work truck and the single axle utility trailer. We do have a second crew going out. So I think this setup uh, with the uh, single trailer will be good to go. I'm really excited to be back here though with the landscaping series. This is a very fun series for me, one of my favorites to record and you guys have been amazing supporters here of the channel as well. We'll get backed up here to the trailer, it's going to be a little tight, it's right up against the fence but I don't think we'll have a problem. Nowadays all these trucks do backup cameras which is pretty helpful and that allows us to get lined right up here and also the wire. Now I really hope one day, one day that we could get awesome kind of uh, the uh, chains there on the uh, trailers but we'll just slowly get by here and we'll get loaded up now I think we'll first load up the uh, leaf uh, blower here I'm taking the big blower just in case we do have some leaves uh, that are a bit heavy it did rain a little bit a few days ago hopefully none of those leaves are soaked and not going to be uh, come off the ground but sometimes they are I hope everyone's been having a fantastic day so far. Let me know how it is down below. My day's been so far pretty good here. I've been doing a lot of schoolwork, but it's always nice uh, to get back behind the computer and do some recording for all of you guys. So we are taking the Sky Cheetah here, the 72 inch with the brand new Leaf Vacuum. Uh, this is pretty awesome here. Now we do have a vacuum system coming for the Grasshopper, and we are putting the bags on our others as well here, so we're good to go there. But let's get this turned on really quickly. I do want to fold out the roll bars just just in case, I always do like it. I think it looks a little bit better with it up as well. We do have a full tank of diesel here in the mower, so we sh uh, should be good to go uh, to go mow just around nine properties. Now I am trying to feature as many landscaping lawn care videos as possible. I'm trying to be as realistic as possible, and I really kind of want to feature more and more editing for all of you guys in the videos. Grabbing a few granola bars here and a bottle of water from the Duramax, the daily driver, let's head on out. Now before you know it guys, the fall leaf season will be over and then it comes the snow. And this year, it is going to be a pretty big one here for us. The weatherman says we're getting a lot of snow, which means we'll be able to push a lot, make a lot of money, and get to use some pretty cool setups. Now all of our trucks, all of our skids, and also uh, the uh, Kubota along with the uh, backhoe will be pushing snow. And I think I think we'll be having three four person uh, crews here for the videos which I think will be awesome. Now this upcoming winter I do want to do a lot more multiplayer videos here which should be pretty fun and I do have a lot planned here. Now this upcoming week we will be back with American Truck Sim and some other videos and some other series that I have not yet featured in a few weeks. Now with bagging all the grass and the leaves, what we are going to do, since it is a work truck, we'll just kind of put all the grass in the back of the uh, bed and then we'll just have to shovel it out. I really want one of those easy dumps here in the truck. Uh, we'll maybe pick one of those up here. I think that might be a really good idea. Let me know if you guys have seen one before. Uh, they are so, so cool here. But let's get the uh, ramp lowered. I think we'll do all the weed eating and all the leaf blowing at the end. I did bring the uh, weed eater and the handheld leaf lower just in case we wanted to use that. But it's always great 
like to use these skag mowers really i'm a big fan i've actually ran a few skags in real life and they are some pretty awesome mowers here now let's see there looks like the deck is down and no it looks like it was up there so good thing i checked we do not want to be mowing and not doing anything here but it looks like there are quite a few leaves on the ground but not as many as what we'll be seeing here in a few weeks but i am a big big fan of the fall not only halloween but also uh, just seeing the leaves uh, change colors all those awesome colors and uh to be uh, playing with the leaves equipment now, if you guys haven't already, I do recommend you go give me a follow over on Instagram. I am posting every single day over there uh, some pretty cool sneak peeks and updates about the channel. And if you guys want all of the mods here in today's video, I do have them up on my website. I've been getting quite a few comments about it saying how it's been so helpful and that was always the plan here. I really wanted a one place area for all of the mod uh, links and you guys have been so far liking it. Now with this bagger, since the grass isn't too tall here, the grass usually doesn't grow too too much in the fall season and uh, the uh, fall months here, especially with the cold. Looks like not too much uh, growth here, just some leaves, so uh, we'll probably be able to do uh, the full property with one bag. Even though it's a small bag, it is kind of compact and we do actually have a really awesome system. Now this bagger that we put on this is uh, at least I think it's like $1,400, $1,500, so it was a bit pricey, but it pays for itself because uh, they really do require it and we have to please the customer. Like I have touched upon guys, I've really been enjoying all these videos here, they've been a ton of fun and uh, the landscaping lawn care is uh, one of the uh, favorite series. One of my favorite videos, just hop on a mower mow and chat with you guys is always great, especially on a Monday, Monday morning and uh, just doing some Monday mowing. Being a 72 inch like this, we are also so efficient here, but I can't wait for the new mowers coming to console. I can't wait for that. We will be doing some Xbox videos and that should be awesome. Now let me know down below in the comments guys if you are planning on getting uh, the new PS5 or the new Xbox Series X here. Some pretty cool mowers. I think those would be nice, uh, uh, nice consoles I mean and we could definitely do some farm some videos on them. Now I really do like this subdivision here, usually I try to get houses uh, all right next to the door to each other, saves us the travel time, instead of driving around town, we're out on the mower all day, which I think is a lot better, and it's a little bit less wear and tear on the trucks as well, but wow, you guys can see, really want wide open areas, not these small backyards uh, like this one here. Now I do still have some more landscaping projects planned here before the end of the season so those should be a lot of fun and I can't wait for everything else we have planned. I hope everyone's been having a pretty good uh, school year so far here. I'm really excited to have a pretty big winter break and I definitely want to get back into live streaming here but I've been really busy and I hope everyone has been uh, doing the school work and just uh, kind of getting it done that way you can enjoy the uh, winter break and all those extra holidays you get. Wow, look at the Skag Cheetah here. I am a big fan of the Cheetah, but I really want some other brands as well here in the game, but also some other mowers, not just the 72 inch, uh, maybe the 36 inch, the small stand-ons, things like that I would really like here in the game. So I think we'll do one more here before we hop on that, and that is actually right across the street here. We'll get the deck raised and we'll get it lowered. We do not want to be hitting the curb uh, as we're going back and forth here, but we'll get this mode and then we'll do the... Uh, collection of the driveway leaves and also we didn't now let me know down below in the comments guys what is your favorite brand here for mowers I use so many different mowers here in the game as well but I really want to get some new ones definitely want to get a Venn track maybe even uh, some more compact tractors Massey Ferguson Kubota things like that and maybe we might use a compact tractor I definitely want to pick one up uh, maybe we could use it for the sidewalks this uh, winter as well uh, for snow blowing. Oh yeah, we'll be able to get this one done. No problem, you guys, since the full speed ahead, the 72 inches are perfect for this. Yeah, look at that. No problem making uh, a lot of time here. It's always great to be mowing and making money. Now I do know that many of you guys do uh, mow lawns in real life, which is pretty awesome. I did do it for a bit of time and I, I really did enjoy it. It's great to start young, get working, and just kind of enjoying and learning as you go. 
Well, I already finished the uh, side here. Just pretty much have the back and this side here. Wow, that's pretty awesome. Both corner lots, usually corner lots are always big, but that is no problem here. It's not too much more, and we do get a little bit of a bigger paycheck. Now the walkers will be coming out a uh, full season here. I can't wait for that as well. Uh, they'll be used for the full October, uh, even part of November here. As we do the leaf cleanups, those are really famous, really well known uh, for having great uh, kind of built-in vacuums. And then we'll be using that a lot for the leaf cleanups, even more uh, than this here, just because of how that performs. And there's a lot more storage in those as well. Now with these, we actually have to add some front weights. I don't think uh, with, uh, how we are on the regular flat grass. I don't think we'll have a problem, but if we do go on any hilly terrains, we might run into a bit of problems there. But you guys can see making really good progress, just about done, and then we'll get going on. That looks to be good, perfect, and just a little bit back here. But lots we did and we have to do. Now I do plan to do quite a bit more editing here for you guys. It is a bit of a different style uh, than what I usually do edit uh, and upload for you guys. But I think it's worth a try so you guys overall like it. And I, I always like to try new things and see how it goes. Now since it is a fall here, we don't really focus on any stripes, any uh, patterns. It's just about getting out and mowing and getting all the leaves cleaned up. Now back here there are a bit more leaves, but overall, uh, with the leaves starting to fall though, it's an awesome time of the year. But I can't wait though for winter. We have so many new trucks, so many new things we could use for the uh, plowing season, which is going to be awesome here. Pretty epic uh, few months coming up here for the channel, and that's pretty much it here. Let's get this uh, kind of right uh, beside it now. I think we'll do the weed eating now. I think this will be the time to do it. Let's grab the weed eater, and let's go around here. It's going to take some time, but we'll do it. Get right around the house here. Now, I really do prefer this weed eater, even though it's only for the kind of role play part. It is a little bit better, in my opinion. Easier to move around. Just kind of feels more realistic as well, uh, since we could really do kind of the human uh, movements on it. Just doing all these basic things really quickly, and then you guys can see just being realistic. Look at that. No problem. And finally, we'll do this edge here, and then we'll blow it. And then I think I will do the other one here off camera. Doing a nice edge here. Always want want the nice edge on that as well. So there we go. Wow, that was pretty quick and easy here for us. Let's get this rolled off, get it fired up, and this is one powerful. I think this is five horsepower here. It's quite a lot of power uh, for a leaf blower here, but that's kind of why you guys see that you have to walk behind it. Let's get this fired up here, you guys, and see this is actually pretty sweet. We got turned on here just really quickly. We'll just kind of blow the driver off. Not sure exactly what's happening. Let's see if we can fix that really quickly here. So we'll just kind of blow it back and forth and like that. Perfect. And we'll go this way here. Now, I really do like these, but they're also one directional, which is a bit tricky here. But hope you guys enjoyed today's lawn care landscaping video. Getting to use this, uh, the cheetah here with the bagger and the leaf blower. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for next one and subscribe for more.